What is up guys, TechRax here. In this video, I got my hands on the brand new iPhone 12 Pro. Now, as you guys already know, this phone has the new ceramic shield. Let's go ahead and turn on this iPhone and man, does it feel good to have those flat edges. Like, I honestly, I love that. I love the iPhone 5 and I just miss that and it's more of a grip. Of course, guys, unfortunately, we don't have a brick this time, but I'm not gonna do an unboxing. Got the knife and uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and do a little zoom in here. And the first few engravings have begun. So in one concentrated area, I'm just gonna do this for, I don't know, maybe 30 seconds. And then after doing that for about 30 seconds, I'm gonna see if it, it will just wipe. Definitely pretty noticeable from this angle, but you gotta really look for them right there on top, as you guys can see, as I'm swiping it, trying to take it away. Just like that, you guys can see kind of those scratches right there I just did with that knife. And with different angles, you can kind of see, you can't tell right there, but if you're looking, I mean, very, very noticeable now. Some nice, good, permanent damage. The moment of truth, we're gonna be dropping this hammer and giving it a few hits as usual. So the first thing I always love to do is just take the hammer and kind of give it a couple drops, just from a little bit, like three inches just to test out the limit. Guys, the new ceramic shield, let's go. Okay, we did it, nice. Survivor from that, let's go a little bit higher. I don't wanna go too high up yet, but this is probably four inches. Okay, I mean, I'm really impressed. Honestly, I would imagine the iPhone would have already cracked at that last drop. So now we're gonna slowly start giving it a few hits, and this is where, I remember last year, the iPhone 11 took a few, like a champ and then it just kinda, kinda got crushed. So let's go ahead and see some light hits here. Just some very, very light hits. Oh, oh my goodness. I did not, honestly guys, straight up, I did not expect it to just crack right away like that. Um, that seemed a lot more fragile. I wasn't giving a lot of power at all, they were very light. It's in my opinion, perfect shape of that hammer right there. Boom. This does not seem that durable. As I'm doing those small little hits, you can already see the cracks are spreading all across the phone here. So now you got all of this here going on. So let me go ahead and just try and do this with the phone off just to show you guys maybe how like how quickly it's spreading that new cracks just like that these are pretty pretty light hits light to medium hits okay phone still works that's good so now I'm gonna go with the medium sized hits give it a lot more power here Okay, well I gotta say I am impressed that the phone is not shutting off, or it's not glitching. Still all cracked all over, but it's working. Turns on and turns off. So I'm kind of upgrading to higher hits here. Now I'm gonna start going with some really heavy hits. Let's check if the back is cracked. Okay, phone still works. It's just shattered all over, but it's working. Ooh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. As you guys can see, here's the final product. Uh, that looks a bit more like it. Now you got some metal, got some color, got some glass, just super crispy. Super nice. Oh my goodness. Does it turn on? No, it does not turn on. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.